Are you looking for the best 5-inch channel amplifier? In this video, we will break down the top 4 5-inch channel amplifier. We have included links in the description for each product mentioned, so make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. At number 1, Rockville DB55. This Rockville 5-channel amp proves to be a powerful musical buddy with its ability to produce a max RMS output of 980 watts. CA compliant power ratings backed by a high-speed MOSFET power supply. To back up all these claims, Rockville is willing to give you back a full refund within 90 days. In addition to the variable low and high pass filters, this amp package is also inclusive of a subsonic filter. If you intend to hook on a bunch of speakers, its dual speaker terminals make this task extremely easy. Its chassis comes with a nice Rockville logo and made of heavy-duty aluminum alloy for maximum heat dissipation. At number 2, Planet Audio OC 1800.5. If you have tried a variety of different mid-range amps and just haven't been able to get the results you want, Give this Planet Audio Amplifier a try. It not only offers some serious wattage for your channels and subwoofer, but it includes some extremely durable interior and exterior construction. One of the biggest issues is this class's slash B amp seems slightly prone to overheating. However, Planet Audio took the bull by the horns and added an oversized aluminum heatsink to help dissipate heat. It also has a very solid and effective thermal protection system in place to prevent damage to your amp and car audio system in case of overheating. While there have been some concerns about the actually stated power ratings from the MOSFET power supply, we found this amp to deliver a solid 225 watts RMS power per channel with an additional 450 watts for your woofer. If you're looking for a big bass boost, this amp can get it done. While it is not a high-end amp for professional car audio systems, it is an extremely versatile mid to high range amp to consider. At number 3, Sony XM GS6 DSB. The Sony XM GS6 DSB has an inbuilt Bluetooth feature for controlling and setting up the amp with the Sony app. If you're a modern day user in love with tech, this amp allows you to stream music using your phone without any radio. It has front four channels that can power up your door speakers at 45W each and two subwoofer channels at 175W each. You can bridge the sub channels at 600W and still use a 2 sub speaker adding to its flexibility. It's versatile and comes in a sleek design. It sounds just as great as it looks and doesn't require much stress for installation. Nice compact look enables you to tuck this nicely underneath your passenger seat or somewhere else. At number 4, ROCK Ford Fosse Punch Pone 1005. In a simple 5-channel setup, the Rockford Fosse Punch delivers 1000 watts of RMS power which is enough to meet the performance demands of marine and power sports audio systems. While the first four channels run the dash and rear speakers, you can hook up a power-intensive marine subwoofer to the fifth 500-watt channel without worrying about distortion. The amplifier has a wear-resistant build quality made from stainless steel hardware that also resists corrosion brought on by exposure to moisture and dirt. This amplifier features a mashup of innovative technologies for maximum performance and durability. A dynamic thermal management system is integrated into the amplifier's construction to promote better heat transfer and prevent overheating when you're cranking up the speakers for a long time. Tri-stage protection shields the circuitry from overcurrent and short circuits, while CLE and setup technology helps to accurately set the gain. Decibel output. Also, its variable high and low pass crossovers help to make the stereo sound quality richer and more detailed. While the amplifier is built with remarkable heat dissipating technology, it can still overheat during extended playtime at loud volumes. It's larger than most amplifiers and that could result in insulation issues in vehicles with limited mounting space. Also, you'd have to buy the base adjustment for the fifth channel separately. Thanks for watching our video. Like, comment, and share with your friends. If you find this video helpful, subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feel.